and welcome to another full body point of view ASMR Reiki session. In today's session, we will be soothing your pain and your discomfort. There will be no tapping in today's video, so for those of you who are sensitive to the sound of tapping, especially when trying to fall asleep, know that you'll be okay for this video. <laughs> Alright, let's get you started. Before we get started with the Reiki portion of today's video, I would like to take a little bit of time just to cleanse your aura, your energy field around you, and remove from it any of the energies of today that have stuck to your energy field. These could be interactions with people, um, maybe certain conversations that you're playing on loop in your head or conversations that you're finishing in your head even though they have long past or maybe you feel like you're carrying the emotion of someone else in your own energy field. So we want to take some time to first release anything that you picked up today and then we can get in um, a lot deeper with the Reiki and the healing. So for today, I am using my homemade incense and I'll be using this candle to light it. If you have an incense at home, or a candle that you like to burn, you can do that too as long as you don't plan to fall asleep to this video definitely don't want to keep a candle burning while sleeping so I'm just going to take some time here to light it so that we get a good smoke going using my eagle feather and I'm not sure if you can see the smoke but we're going to gently brush that through your aura and as you imagine the smoke gently enveloping you and the feather brushing through your energy field just feel the energies of today falling away, falling to the background of your mind, and maybe even fully being released. Let go of any conversations that you've had today, or any conversations that you want to have future and allow yourself to fully arrive back into the present moment Reiki symbols right by your third eye and we do this to energetically activate the session and as I draw each symbol I will gently press it into your aura like so really good. So, first thing we want to do here is 
start creating some space in your body. A lot of times when we experience discomfort and pain, we tend to contract with the pain. We tend to pull our energy inwards and contract it into itself and we actually want to do the opposite. We want to create a sense of spaciousness in the body so that the energy can keep flowing and so that your body can heal itself more easily. Really all we're doing here right now today is stepping out of the way and allowing our body to take over and to do what it does best which is healing, bringing back things into balance so as you inhale, take a deep breath in imagine creating space between your cells with your breath and then on the exhale Imagine your body softening into the surface that you're on right now. So on the inhale, breathing more space between your cells, all the cells of your body. And on the exhale, softening. Letting go. Good. Deep breath in. Creating space, exhale, softening. Good, deep breath in. Creating as much space as you can now. And exhale, soften. Deep breath in. Continue to breathe in this pattern. I will be using this black tourmaline crystal to now start removing some of that pain from your body. What I'm trying to kind of pull from your aura right now is any sort of imbalances, any sort of blockages that are creating the sense of constriction of pain. So, I'll be gliding this through your aura and like a magnet, this black tourmaline will be um, absorbing any of the excess energy in your body that is creating this blockage and any energy that doesn't belong. So on the inhale, continue to imagine creating spaciousness in your body creating more space between the cells and on the exhale, softening even more fully surrendering to the space or the surface below you and the space around you good, a few more deep breaths in Deep inhale, slow exhales, and if you feel called, you can even sigh it out to release some excess energy, if that feels good to you. Good, and feel any excess energy being lifted out of your aura being absorbed by the black tourmaline. Let it go. Allow it to leave your energy system. Good. Going to focus in a little bit around your mind here to pull out any overthinking or overanalyzing energies. Gonna sweep those up and remove them like so. Good. And then I'm going to be removing energy around your root as well. Any energy. 
energies that have to do with fear. Whether it's the fear of feeling pain as you're experiencing it right now, or maybe fear that is causing the pain. Good. Channeling the energy down, grabbing it. focusing on the major chakras, but also the minor chakras. So, we're going to get started by your head and then work our way all the way down the body, okay? We're going to start at the top of your head by your crown chakra. So I'm just going to come up behind you here and just place my hands at the top of your head, the highest point of your head. And all I want you to do is to soften the crown of your head. Imagine the crown of your head opening like a flower, petal by petal. Softening into the space around you. Feel the muscles of your head relax and soften. Even softening the bone of your skull. Good. And then I'm going to place my hands on either side of your face, cupping your ears. Imagine your ears softening. Soften the inside of your ears as well. Opening your ears to the space around you. Allow the Reiki energy to heal any pain when it comes to hearing or ear pains. Relaxing the sides of your head. Letting go of tension. And moving to your forehead, your third eye. Soften the skin of your forehead. Relaxing into the space around you. Relaxing the muscles of your forehead. The bone of your forehead. And if you have any headaches that you're dealing with or maybe any sort of mental pains, emotional pains, allow these to soften. Soften yourself around the pain. Good. 
going down to your neck now. Allow the front and the back of your neck to soften. Softening into the space around you. Releasing any tension from your vocal cords. And from the muscles of your neck. If you have any throat issues that you're dealing with, any aches and pains here, just soften around the sensations that you feel. Create a sense of softness around the discomfort. I'm going to place my hand on your shoulders, the tops of your shoulders here. Allow the muscles of your shoulders to melt, to relax into the space below you, the surface below you. Create space between your shoulders and your head, so really elongate your neck here, creating space. If you're dealing with any shoulder pains or any stress-related discomfort here, just visualize creating softness around the discomfort. Don't fight the discomfort, don't contract around it, just soften. Allow it to be here, it's all good. Your body will take care of it from the moment that you start relaxing. Okay. I'm now going to place my hands on either collarbones, the bones here at the top of your chest. Just imagine the top of your chest softening and opening up. Blurring into the space around you. Release the grip that you have on your chest. If you have any chest pains, especially in the the upper parts, or maybe you have trouble breathing. Again, just visualize creating softness around the discomfort. Releasing any grip that you have on the pain, just give it space. Moving down to the center of your chest right here, your heart chakra. Sending Reiki energy to your heart and the, the deeper part of your lungs. If you're dealing with any heartache, maybe physical heart pain or Emotional heart pain, heartbreak. Send love, send softness to those sensations that you feel. Release any fear you have around the pain and just soften into the sensations. Allow the energy point, the chakra of your heart to open up like a flower, petal by petal. 
opening itself up to the space around you. Good. Now placing my hands on the elbows and sending Reiki energy to your elbows and the whole of the upper arms. So if you have any pain in the upper arms or the shoulders here or the tops of the arms I'm sending Reiki energy to that now and again all you have to do is soften release, let go Breathing softness into those spaces of discomfort. And not constricting ourselves around it. Okay. Going to now place my hands on the inside of your hands, the palms of your hands. So if you haven't yet, maybe flip your hands upwards and just visualize my hands being placed onto your hands here, the inside of your hands. And I'm sending Reiki energy now to the forearms, the wrist, and the hands. So if you're dealing with any wrist pains or any other pains of the forearms and the hands, I'm specifically targeting those parts of your body now. And just surrender to the weight of the air on your skin. Softening the barrier between your body and the space around you. And breathing softness into any discomfort here. Okay. Now we're going to go to the solar plexus located in the upper abdomen right here. And here we are sending Reiki to the organs that lie in the upper part of our abdomen, such as our stomach, our liver, the kidneys, and the back. Again, don't forget to use your breath. If it gets too uncomfortable here, just continue to breathe space into your body, into your cells. All you have to do is soften. going to pull some energy here. I feel there's quite a lot of heat in my hands here, so there must be a lot of energy to remove. Okay. Now we're moving to the lower abdomen, so I'm going to place my hands um, just underneath your belly button. We're going to be targeting the um, lower organs in in our um, stomach or our belly cavity. So right now, in specific, we're sending Reiki energy to 
your intestines, your small and big intestines, your reproductive organs, your bladder. So if you're having any sort of issues of discomfort or pain in the lower part of your belly, sending Reiki energy specifically to those parts now. Allow your lower belly to completely soften, surrendering into the space below you, the surface you're laying on, and the space above you, the air around you. Continuing to breathe space into your lower belly, allowing your energetic body to expand outwards on the inhales and soften on the exhales. Now we're going down to the root chakra, which is located deep within the hips, um, located by your tailbone, but deep in the center um, of your hips. I'll be placing my hands on either side of your hip, like so, um, just to reach it a little easier in that way. Here as well, as you inhale and you pull the air down to your hips, just imagine your actual two hip bones separating from one another just a little bit. Creating space for the organs here in your hip bowl, the bowl of your hips. And more specifically here, I'm going to be sending Reiki energy to the muscles of the hip or the hips. We tend to hold on to a lot of tension in our hips, a lot of stress, a lot of repressed emotions. So just continue to soften your hips. Softening the fronts of your hips, the backs of the hips, and the deeper inner parts of the hips. Feel that space at the bottom of your tailbone, at the very bottom of your spine, opening up, softening. Removing any excess energy that is coming up here that's being released. And then moving down to your knees. So now we'll be sending Reiki energy to your knees, but also the upper thighs, both at the front and at the back of the upper thighs. So just feel your whole upper legs, the right one and the left one, your right knee and your left knee, softening. Feel them relaxing down, melting into the surface below you. And if you have any pain here in the upper legs and the knees, just melt yourself around the pain, softening around it. You don't have to protect yourself from the pain. Your body knows what to do. All we have to do is step out of the way.
And then lastly, I'll be placing my hands on the tops of your feet. We're going to be sending Reiki to your actual feet, the right one and the left one, but also the lower legs. So if you're dealing with any pain in the lower legs, in the feet, in your ankles, we are now actively sending Reiki to those parts. Allowing the lower legs to soften, melting into the space around you. Fully letting go. There's no need to hold on here. Just surrender. some of the energy out now, anything that's coming out as we're releasing. Okay. Going to go in with our little feather brush and just gently brush away any little particles of energy that we might have missed that have come up as we have opened up and released. Just going to swoosh these out of your energetic field. Just brush that away. spaces here in your um, aura. We're just gonna fluff it out. Just make sure it's taking up its proper space. A healthy aura is a wide aura.